Hello there, everyone. My name is Martin, and welcome back to my Vote of Art YouTube channel, where I support and appreciate different forms of art. And I am continue my bandmate journey to their first full album, New Beginning. I already did Freezer last time and Beauty and the Beast, which I freaking loved. We Existence, Full and Don't Let Me Down, uh, I know already, of course, and whacked it to a music video, so... When you haven't seen it, check this out. But still, there are four songs left. Shake That, Don't Apply the Break, Acadia the Girl, and today, Price of Pride. Let's see. with Scarpan. I don't know how I did it, but I really captured the sound of the 2000s. This rock, this punk, this this hard rock feel from from the riffs, from how it's structured, from the the sound. This is really like so has this nostalgic feel for me because the 2000s were my childhood basically. This was when I was growing up. That's why this sound, this punk rock, this college rock, and uh, all all these things. And here a little bit this dead 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 ska punk feel. Uh, and then dun, dun, the drums and everything. I always love when you hear the guitar uh, squeaks and stuff. Well, that's why I love guitars because you can do so many stuff and bring so many great sounds of it, which uh, you can add in the 
in an album, in a track. And that's the amazing thing. Yeah, you can, I mean, look at Eddie Van Halen, uh, what he did with his guitar. So the, the electric guitar, you can do a lot of crazy things to hear this all. And also the synth here in the back. Also an interesting, the vocals were really in a mid-range. Even Miko here, the uh, newest album, you know, uh, they are her own own song we, where she really hit it hitting well hitting the high notes and to this day in live performances we saw it i mean i worked it last sunday to unleash the live performance and there you hear it so much the how much higher and wider the vocal um the range is of course it makes sense because both of them were in, in the beginning there and because psyche started with a really low tone miko also fitting in perfectly but i will laugh at how this is. again we didn't hear this walk hard work in the beginning this is so the drumming and everything and the guitar we were so walking and here we have the typical band match sound this catchiness in it uh, mel guitar melodies and riffs and then also the vocals everything is laid down together with the drums and it's so pleasant it's so like yeah the sound i love i just love this catchiness it's so happy yeah here this with the guitar, with the uh, ska punk, this and again, uh, in the early days, Bamet had a punk, punkish flair into it. Uh, this uh, vibe nowadays, we have more progressive vibes. Uh, where Misa doing more stuff on the bass, all of them doing their own stuff, and it's yeah, that's why it's fitting now that the vocals are more open and more in high and low. That's really. It's so amazing. They're starting out really, um, you know, close. The sound really beautiful late, and now it's opened up more, and it's more playtime, more uh, experimenting, and that's what I love. I love music when it's uh, straightforward. Ah, uh, we have in heavy metal, we have songs that are straightforward and just working hard, but also progressive vibes or when a little multiple breaks and change ups. Everything is good as long as it's. It has to be melodic. It has something. Okay, it has. To, to be something you can catch or you can you you can follow when it's, when it's too much noise and too much when you cannot really follow where it's taking me where's the white going it's i need always something that leads and batman does it always <laughs> Here you hear it perfectly where both the vocals vocals um from the tone are very similar. There's no really like that B goes much higher or lower. It's really like um uh, really belongs there. Uh, and uh, yeah. You really can also now understand that uh, Saki's voice is now there we, we, it's fantastic because she's now can open up and it's even more powerful you, you hear it here the wasp and everything but it's now she can hit these notes you know and it's fantastic <laughs> especially when both of them sing at the same time this has really this this punkish uh, punk rock flair uh, expect the vocal <laughs> Always love here also the change up. Uh, Psyche sings and then Miku came in and so like this uh, changing up and singing together. And because as I said, the, the vocals, the their um, range is here pretty similar, it's fitting so much. It's really, really great to listen to. So this was great. Uh, can't wait to check out the other ones. Uh, I really enjoyed this album. Anyways, goodbye.